artificial general intelligence. If you could paint a dystopian and a utopian picture, let's say there is AGI. What happens to the society post AGI from uh, jobs? If we knew that all it did was make a lot of jobs, say, three times more productive. So doctors are three times more productive. So, you know, the demand for more people to see doctors and get good advice, that's probably good. For software, the fact that over time, and we don't know the, the rate of improvement, and there doesn't seem to be an upper bound, if it gets so that it's a complete replacement, that it can do all the medical advice or it can do all the coding, that's a world of excess where, you know, it's it's got to be wonderful in the sense that, you know, handicapped people, old people, you're, you know, taking care of them, you're shortening the, the work week. But you can get to a point where the very organizing principles of society and the whole philosophy about, you know, what you value, that world of excess, which I personally think won't come in the next 20 years, but I can't guarantee.